Hey guys, it is the like gold here and today well today I'm gonna be talking about something that just released just now it's not like the actual thing but uh trailer for it came out just like to uh, I don't know the 31st today uh, or this is going at night time <laughs> um anyways uh this is uh, about the new DLC that's coming out for Black Ops 3 and it's called uh Eclipse. Sorry, I <laughs> I'm I'm reading this off of a clip note. Um but yeah, this is uh there's a new DLC that's coming out. There is already a, somewhat of a trailer for it. It's uh it's a prologue for the zombie storyline. Um, I don't think there is one for the multiplayer maps yet. I'm not sure. These are shown on the Call of Duty YouTube thing. They posted uh, in English, but also in different languages. So you can click on those. Watch it. Alright, so the first thing we're going to talk about is actually the new zombie map that's coming out that's gonna come out um, the name of the zombies map is called Zetsubo no Shima I know <laughs> I, this is like the first time I'm reading it so I'm just, uh, yeah but what it is is apparently it it's one of Treyarch's uh, it's one of Treyarch's or what they say is their called mm, what's it called Zetsubo no Shima and I think they said uh, this what the translation was it was island of despair and uh, apparently this is taken back to World War 2 era like somewhere around around there during the pers uh, or around the Pacific Islands and we still haven't got any new new other characters but we do have uh what's it, we do have the original so yeah um it looks like they're introducing new transport mechanics uh some the uh uh new devastating traps in classic zombies slide yeah, or side quests. So yeah, that's what's going on for zombies. Uh, I don't think it, it shows it that much. Um, let's see. Uh, it says because of the cause of the experiment with one element one one five. Uh, it will have horrible, horrifying effects on humans, animals, and plant biology but now that I think of it we haven't really seen any plant like actual plant zombies or anything like that so that's that's actually quite interesting um but now uh, we're moving on to the multiplayer maps and I'm just gonna quick give you a quick rundown on what the actual names are there and there's uh Spire, uh, Rift, Knockout, and uh, Verge. I, I, Verge. I, I don't know. Yeah. So what Spire is is a uh, it's a com it's a multiplayer combat to a futuristic suborbital airport. Terminal set high in the clouds. All right, so basically, it's it's just like a futuristic airport, uh, pretty much going into space. I guess it's like up there. So that's that's pretty cool. I have not looked at the pictures for these things yet, but um, yeah. Rift. Head to the core of a harsh futuristic military complex set high above in an active 
Keldura. Keldura. Uh, rift funnels and forces tight intense engagements where the only way through it is forward. Okay, so it's just pretty much mili military. So that's that's pretty standard, I guess. Knockout. Housed in a traditional Shaolin temple with a retro twist. First of all, I'm, I would just like to say this. This sounds interesting already. I'm actually excited for that map. Um, Alright. Uh, Knockout sets the stage for a bloody kung fu tournament. This mid sized map showcases a sharp contrast between the mid-range engagements of the traditional exterior architecture and the tight closed corners quarters of a of an el elastic 1970s style interior I'm, I'm not really sure what they mean by that but okay and uh, Verge is in this reimagination of the classic Call of Duty World at War map, Banzai, Verge drops multiplayer <laughs> combat into the center of a distant post -apop 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 I don't know, apocalyptic future. There we go. Where two. Well, if you guys like the video, you should like the video. And if you like this content, subscribe. Bye!